People are just gonna go back to partying. That uh, an explosion is just a normal occurrence around here. What is going on guys? Off here. Welcome back to Hitman Episode 2. Let's get right into the next game. Rick Henderson, first edition. He's expecting you. This what is wrong with this guy's hair? He has no sense of style. And all of the characters look like James Bond 007 models. All with that same DK face. I've been looking forward to this. As have I, Mr. Alexander. Don't let's stand on ceremony. Call me Jack. Rick. Make yourself comfortable, Rick. Hi, Rick. Where's Coral? Coral. I admire your work. Real journalism. Thanks. I thought we'd start with your thoughts on the White House attack, then discuss your tenure as director of the FBI, post-retirement reflections, whatever, and Rick. Or if you want to sound off on politics. Rick. My apologies. I'm sorry to have lured you here under false pretenses, but I couldn't risk a leak. I'm not sure I understand. Don't worry. It's the scoop of the century. If I had a dime for every time I heard that... Listen, please. It begins with a little incident at a vineyard in Chile that caught my eye some time ago. This was a family business. Fernando Delgado and his son Manuel. Well-liked, hard-working men. Have a look at the folder. So I'm going to go ahead and straight away buy this very useful attachment for the silver baller gun because silence is key in a game where you're trying to kill people. These are the guys we have to kill. We have to kill Fernando Delgado and his son, Manuel. So this is a mission I've done a lot already. So I know that there's a guy that is due to be at the back of this structure right about now and he will leave instantly so I'm gonna go ahead and prepare the fiber wire so I can get a really important costume hey dude how you doing how's it going you enjoying the party that's nice come over here and just like that we are now a farmer and I need to put him away right away because I know there are people coming I believe So that's what I remember. Let's see if I remember anything else that crucial. I think I should come back for that suit. Because there's a penalty if I don't get it right away. So this is going to get me through this area, though I could stand in this area, but this is the only area I'm allowed in as 47. But this area, I need either that costume or this costume. And I know the big cheese lives in this house here I can't get past that sergeant there but if I, if I remember correctly there's a pole somewhere that I can climb I believe it's this one and I don't think anyone's watching me so I can just go for it now I wonder if there's a guy over here to catch me I don't think he's around right now so I can come through this window just fine <laughs> he didn't make any noise, he just got surprised by me. Um, We're going to go ahead and take that one. That one's fine. I wanted to strangle him in the chair, but I can still deal with him like this. That's, that's cool. That's fine. I guess I walked in a little bit too fast. But this is A-OK. -okay. Get rid of the body. He was never here to begin with. I got his gun. Also, I just need to get out of here safely, so I think I'll go back the way I came. As long as there's no one out here looking at me, I think I'm fine. 
Yep. Okay, let's move. Come on. Go down. Okay, now in reality, if someone sees us on this pole, I think it's just suspicious, but not like, you're trying to murder someone, you know? Okay. Now the other guy... I forget where he is, but I know it has something to do with this building. Let's go see what this is in here. This is the guards' barracks, I believe. There's a guy sleeping. These guys are listening to the radio. There's a closet. Power. Power. Power that goes to this building. I need to get an outfit. I need to get a guard outfit. I need to get an, a guard outfit. Oh! <laughs> How convenient is that? Okay. I believe the power turns off. Yeah. Because look at that. That goes into the wall over there. So, if I can get this guy out of this room without killing him straight up, because he's going to see me, I can make him leave and say, hey, what the hell's going on with the power? Steal that suit and walk out scot-free. No one's coming. Rip the power. Okay. Don't mind me, just the farmer. Going to work. Do 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 do. Yeah, the strange thing about that power, um, you better go check it out. You know, and just totally not come back for like two minutes. We cool. Alright, no one around. I can change into this suit. That's fine. And we can leave. I'll go back out this way. We need this suit to get over here. Only guards are allowed in this area. I hope. If I'm not, then this is, was a terrible mistake. Okay, there's a guard right there. I'm fine. This is where the other guy is. Instantly, I see a way to kill him. This trap right here. It probably ne means I need to put a bomb on this winch here. Right, so that's one way. Okay, so we just killed the father, now we need to kill the son. See, this falls immediately right here, so at some point he must come over here for like a cigarette or something like that. But here we are in the wine cellars. And just have to locate him. Where is he? Oh, he's coming this way. He's right there. That way. Yep, there he is. How you doing, bruh? How's it going? I'm here to murder you. Oh, you're just doing a line of coke? Okay, no problem. Do your thing. I am totally fine with that. Well, that guy's watching, so I can't really get over here and do this. There's way too many guys around. Huh. A shotgun ammo. I don't need it, because that's way too loud. Hmm. I mean, I could do it old school and just secretly kill him, but I would need to kill these two guys first. And I don't think that's going to work. There's some people making out over here, so i got to keep my eye on them. I guess I just got to watch his pattern. Because I do not remember it at all. Are you going to be over here by yourself? There's a box right here. I could have just taken him right here. Opportunity missed. Are you going in that corner? Go in the corner. Go in the corner. Just go chill in the corner, man. Go have, like, you know, a cigarette after your, 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 your coke fix. Yep. Okay, cool. Place the bomb without being seen. Is he still down there? Uh, he might be gone. Nope, he's still there. Okay, okay, pull it out. Kill the son, bitch. Oh no, what happened? What's going on? 
Let's go check on him. He's still alive. He moved. Wow. Okay, well, now they're on high alert. Yeah, uh, odd thing about that uh, fixture up there. Man, they... They, uh... They don't build things like they used to. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. Oh, boy. Someone should fix that winch. That was horrible. Well, now I think the guards are going to be on higher alert now. These people, I've ruined their time. How unfortunate. <laughs> he moved. I hesitated. People are just going to go back to partying. That uh, An explosion is just a normal occurrence around here. Do you think this calls for a do-over or should we follow him? Let's continue to follow him, see if we can kill him another way, because that was awful. I could take him right now and just run. But I won't. Maybe there's a box here? There is a box here, but he's already run. Uh, back to the coke. I could just shoot him and run. Though I think that would be way too obvious. What do you think, we shoot him and run? Nope, he's done. Do do do. Hey, you ever notice that um, lives are not that long? Shame about those things about lives. Please don't come this way. Please don't come this way. Okay. Alright, job is done. Now we just need to get off of the island, which is... Which is more complicated than it looks. Okay, there's no clear path to the plane. But... There's a secret passage down here. It's one of these. But I don't think I'm allowed back here. But I think I'm allowed to open it. There it is. Okay. The guard isn't watching. Uh. I don't think he saw me. So I'm gonna hide in here. I think I gotta get in one of those masks. Yep. Okay. Okay, there's a sergeant right there, so we gotta get a cut. And it's so conveniently placed. Okay, sweet. Okay, going to work. <laughs> going to work. Completely normal and relaxed. Not nervous at all. Totally don't have this barcode on the back of my head. How you doing? Hey, Bobby, how you doing over there? Everybody's testing out the products. Everybody's having a good time. We're doing Breaking Bad stuff. We're cool. Everybody's good. Hey, how you doing, Rich? I'll see you at the party next week. Okay, where is the exit? There is the exit right there. At least I believe it is. Oh, hey, it's already coming up. Johnny, how you doing? See ya. Oh, we could also get up there and steal a costume if we needed to. Oh, I don't know how I would have gotten up there. What? I guess that's an interesting dynamic if I just never got this costume. Okay, and there's our plane. I remember this game quite well. Let's get out of here. I forgot the damn suit, but I don't think there's any way I can get it. So, we're just gonna have to go like this. And somehow he has the suit on. <laughs> These are our stats. We got three total kills. Who did we kill? Oh, we killed the, we killed the farmer. And... Three close combat kills, which were the three guys. There were no accidents because he magicianed himself out of the way, which was pretty cool, but frustrating. So we would have been done a lot sooner, but I think we did a pretty clean job because I was not caught on camera. And we earned the rating Hitman. So we are a Hitman. Very little violence was involved. Notoriety has not gone up. We earned nearly $500,000, but I spent $5,000 to retrieve the suit and uh, $3,000 for damage control. I think that was the one guy that I killed, so that sucks, but hey, I still got half a million dollars for that. That's 
that ain't nothing to sneeze at. These little articles at the end are interesting because it gives you a rating on how well you did. So based on how well you did, they write a more interesting story about you. So for example, let's see, if we go down like halfway, the police have absolutely no clue of the killer's appearance as nobody claims to have seen him or her, which means I did this job pretty well. And that's all for this video, guys. I will see you guys in the next episode. And remember that you cannot kill an idea. See you guys next time. Ow.